More than 150 dogs rescued from the crisis situation in Texas are now safely here in Colorado. Moms and Mutt's Colorado Animal Rescue has stepped up to help, and we spoke to the founder, Aaron Jones, about how they're helping out. The photojournalist Tommy Palinuk shows us. It's madness, yeah. It, there's a lot of puppies here. <laughs> lots of moms, lots of puppies, um, lots of nursing moms. Really scared. This is what we do every single week. We have volunteers back there bathing puppies, pulling them off the van, getting them ready to go into their foster homes. I think there's 84 on this transport, and then there's 86 on Friday's transport. Um, so a little over 160 dogs. It's gotten a little insane. There's not enough rescues to handle the overpopulation problem in Texas. We work to kind of help people with that problem. We got a lot of attention last week because it was so cold in Texas. It was really urgent that we get down there as quickly as possible. There's just not enough people down there willing to hold dogs in their home. There's no fosters down there. If they would have had to stay outside, they wouldn't have survived. The puppies wouldn't survive. The moms, if they gave birth, the puppies would freeze. Every single dog on this transport does have a foster. We do need fosters every single week. We have, I believe most of our dogs are covered for today, Friday, and then the March 2nd transport, but we need fosters every week. Can I hand you these puppies really quick? Um, and there are shots of them? <laughs> The organization is still looking for other donations like towels, blankets, dog beds, and toys. You can check out the Moms and Mutts Facebook page for information on those uh, donations that they need.